Now, the friends and family members of Bhima Koregaon accused have reacted to the death of activist and Swami. They say that this is not a natural death, but an institutional murder. Let's listen in. Okay, so these are reactions we are getting to know uh, in terms of inputs that we have is that the family and friends of uh, St Father Stan Swami now believe that this is actually an institutional murder. Stan Swami would have been alive if he was not made to go through the grueling process of being in jail since October last year. The family members say that they are deeply pained by the loss of Father Stan Swami. This is an institutional murder and they hold negligent jails responsible and the probe agencies responsible for it. Cross to Santia Gora joining us with, with more inputs uh, on the story. Santia, at the moment, we are getting to know, Santia, that Stan Swami's family is particularly upset with the fact that he had to go through those grueling months in jail. They are holding the jails responsible and the agency is responsible for the demise of Father Stan Swami. Unfortunately, I couldn't uh, really hear your question. But we're talking about this uh, statement which the family members and the friends of uh, family members of other accused in the case and friends of uh, late father Sam Swami has uh, issued. The statement actually talked about a uh, first the work which was done by uh, father Sam Swami about how he dedicated his life for uh, tribal communities and second, he uh, fought for their rights. Uh, especially to uh, like to their lands, like to their resources, uh, and this uh, statement is also talking is actually uh, alleging that it is actually a judicial murder, which is uh, his death is actually a judicial murder. This is what the uh, statement reads. The statement is talking about the fact that how uh, when Father Stan Swami was arrested, uh, you know all the documents were completed by that time, and I didn't even uh, see his custody, uh, so his arrest not really uh, required, but despite his uh, his age, his illness, that is both because of the Parkinson's disease, he was still arrested. Uh, and uh, the statement talks about his time in the jail and how he was uh, for those who were his inmates. So this is actually a detailed statement which reads that at the time of Father San Swami's arrest, a moving video statement was issued by him where he said that NIA was accusing him of a mild Constant based on certain documents recovered from his computer, documents which he had never seen before, and certainly did not place them in his computer. So uh, the statement also is trying to focus on that how NIA did not have enough proof uh, to uh, arrest and frame Father Sansom in this case. So, uh, and as I said, this particular statement is issued by uh, the family members of the two uh, accused uh, of the family in this case and some of his friends. Mm -hmm. All right. Thanks for joining us, Santia, with the latest information.